Right now at 9:13, a community-wide initiative underway to get food to those in need. The Northern Illinois Food Bank is holding a National Day of Service as part of Hunger Action Month. More than 240 volunteers will spend the day bagging up fresh produce to be distributed to area food pantries and feeding programs. This is happening at centers located in four Chicago suburbs. And joining us live this morning is Shannon Thompson, director of volunteers for the Northern Illinois Food Bank. Shannon, good morning. Thanks for being with us. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Okay, right now you're in Lake Forest at the center there where the day of service has already begun. It looks like it's bustling behind you. Tell us more about it. I am, yes. They're, they're having a lot of fun behind me already. We just started about 10 minutes ago, and we've got a great group here from Reynolds. Very excited that they have chosen to spend part of their day with us today. So different corporations are sending teams of volunteers there? Yes, individuals and corporations. Um, we've got groups at uh, three of our centers today and uh, volunteers just coming on out to take a little time out of their day to make a difference. You know, fresh produce is such a concern and is so needed, especially in food deserts and by folks who are suffering from food insecurity. So who is this food for? Who exactly will you be helping? So uh, this center specifically in Lake Forest is supporting our Lake, uh, Lake County and McHenry County neighbors. So um, we distribute to 200 different food pantries and uh, food assistance sites in this area. So all of the <clears throat> apples and potatoes that are packed up here today are going to go out to those folks. Shannon, according to uh, the Food Bank's president and CEO, you've seen an increase in need of about 30% compared to last year. We know inflation and food prices have been a real problem for a lot of folks, and particularly those who are in desperate need. What, what else is contributing to the increase in need for your food bank? What else has contributed to the need? Is that what you said? <laughs> yes. That you've seen the spike. In I think I lost him. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. You've seen so much. They're having so much fun behind me. I can barely hear it. Right. I mean, um, that's a yes. Good thing. Uh, I mean, inflation. Um, I mean, so, so many things have contributed to the factors of of those that are are still in need. Um, you know, it would be our hope that we're kind of in the business of putting ourselves out of business, but unfortunately, folks still need help, and so um, that's why we're all here today to to kind of continue to help our neighbors that are that are in this area, which is such an important and noble cause, of course. And finally, for those seeing this and wondering how they can help beyond today's day of service. What can they do? <clears throat> they can sign up to volunteer. Uh, we have shifts at all four of our centers. Uh, some of those are directly kind of doing what's happening behind me, sorting and packing food and other opportunities. Uh, can, you can get involved with directly serving a neighbor, so you can help at, at some um, outdoor sites and some indoor sites. Um, lots of different opportunities for people to get involved, um, and that happens um, all week long, pretty much Monday through Saturday. We've got shifts at all four of those centers. Um, you can also, because it's Hunger Action Month, um, you can um, get involved. We have a 30 days and 30 ways uh, calendar that's on our website that will help you kind of find different things that you can do throughout the month. Um, we still have lots of time this month to get involved, so check that out. Um, our website is solvehungertoday.org, so you can sign up to volunteer that way. You can check out the 30 ways in 30 days. And you also, if you volunteer in the month of September, or if you are a volunteer with us already, thank you. Um, but if you are, you also can um, triple it up. You can make a donation, a monetary donation, in addition to your time. And that match um, is going to be matched triple, um, basically. So if you donate, $10, um, your donation will be $30, and that's going to help us provide um, about 240 meals to someone that, um, two, I'm sorry, $240 worth of groceries that will help one of our neighbors in the area. So it's a great way to maximize your gifts, your time, and your money. Absolutely. Yeah, Shannon, thanks so much. I love how you said that. We're in the business of putting ourselves out of business, but until that happens, we hope and pray it will one day. You guys are filling the gap and stepping in for need. We'll have a link to more details on the Food Bank and Hunger Action Month on our website. See be a Chicago.com.